eight. It is Thursday, so uh, hopefully you had a great day and a good night. Uh, I, I know in my place here it rained quite a bit, so it was nice to hear the rain. So our gospel today, there was two options, and I chose the one that the bishops put on their website. It's for Matthew chapter five, verses twenty through twenty-six. There's two options because today is the feast day of Saint Barnabas, not one of the apostles. The apostles chosen. Uh, after the, the disciples got together and to replace Judas. But anyway, so Jesus, this gospel is a continuation of where we've been. So Jesus is teaching again the disciples and teaching them about the law. Remember yesterday, he talked about the law. He came to fulfill the law, not abolish it. He talks more about the law. And what he does, uh, you know, yesterday I talked about not enforcing it. Uh, it's not about enforcing, it's about living it. And this is where Jesus gets into it. Uh, and what he does is he ramps it up. Uh, he, he decries those people who only do it on a superficial level or only do the bare minimum. And Jesus says, no, the law is about love. And so we need to, to really live it out and, uh, and to make it real and real present. He says, you know, he says, you shall not kill and whoever kills will liable judgment. Well, I'll tell you, if you're angry with your brother, then you're liable to judgment. So he's equating that, that maintaining of anger with even killing. So he's ramping it up. And it's a good insight for us. Uh, of course, we can't be uh, too scrupulous, and meaning that we can't be so fixated on the details that, you know, make sure we're following every little letter. Like, that's just bad. Uh, that leads to another thing. That's another reflection. But what Jesus is saying is, you know, how conscious are we of our actions? And are we living out love? You know, are we doing it on a superficial level? Or is it really coming from a heart? And I think if we are, if we've truly experienced that freedom of Christ, if we are truly saved, then it does come from our heart. We're doing this not because we have to, but because we want to, because we want to make changes uh, for the world. We want to improve things. We want to live out our humanity. And that's a hard challenge for any of us. Um, you know, myself, <laughs> Pretty easy to get lazy, uh, pretty easy to get burnt out, uh, and pretty easy to get frustrated with other people too. Um, but I think Jesus calls us to something more, not to let ourselves be controlled by the frustration, by the anger, by the laziness, and to think beyond it. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry about that. So that's where we're at. So y'all have a good day. Uh, enjoy. Uh, I finally get to get my hair cut today. So Deb DeRuz, I'll see you later this afternoon, okay? Take care. Bye-bye.